I never knew Jason when he weighed 300 pounds. When we met, he had already lost most of the weight. But after hearing his story, I thought, people need to hear this. Today, obesity has become far too common. It traps people under the weight, the excuses, and leaves them unable to see the world the way it was intended. Jason overcame his obesity. He chose a different path, and there was nothing easy about it. This is the story about that struggle, that pain, that fight. Seven years ago, I was 300 pounds. I felt stuck, convinced that it was my destiny to be overweight. The idea of losing weight seemed impossible. The idea of running a single mile, also impossible. But on August 18th, 2018, at 4 a.m., I will be on the starting line of the Leadville 100, a 100-mile foot race almost two miles above sea level with elevation gains of over 12,000 feet. I'll only have 30 hours to finish. And when I do, it will be the latest step in a seven year journey to prove that impossible is nothing more than a word. The thing about Jason and his weight loss was that it was a one way direction for him. There was no going back. As he lost the weight, he would donate all of his larger clothes. He would not keep a single item of clothing that was that larger size because for him, this was a permanent change and there was no going back. And I think for him, that decision that this was a one-way direction was what motivated him just to have a better lifestyle. This is a lifestyle, it's not a diet, it's not a one-time change, it's a permanent series of changes that continue to lead us in a life that is moving forward. People in the endurance community know Leadville as an endurance mecca. The race presents a variety of issues. It's 100 miles. It's also at or above 10,000 feet for a significant amount of rate. It's a lot harder to breathe at that altitude because the air is much thinner. Couple that with sleep deprivation, the amount of vertical gain that you have to run throughout the race, running up mountains. All of those things come together to really create a challenge that it's not just, I'm gonna run 100 miles. It's I'm gonna run the Leadville 100. That's daunting to even some of the world's best runners. Jason has the kind of courage that I wish I could bottle up and force feed myself every morning. He's already accomplished more than he ever will during a 100 mile foot race. But he's not done. The fight is never finished. Ah, it's no joke. Seven and a half miles, 5,000 feet of elevation. Not enough water. But thankful to be here. I'd love for you to go that way. I'm gonna go this way. You're good. You stay there, I'll stay here. <laughs> 